everybody, it's me, Ashley. I know I didn't do a video last week. That was my 16th week, which makes this week my 17th week. Today I'm 17 weeks and um, four days. So, how have you guys been? Um, I'm doing great today. And um, today I did something that I never ever do. I, well, that I've never ever done, or that I never do, either or. Uh, I let MJ stay with his grandparents. They were off all week, and they kept asking me to, um, you know, if you need a break or something, you can let him come over. Um, and honestly, I, I don't like doing that, but my head was hurting so bad yesterday, and I was so tired. And exhausted that I was like you know what yeah let's make this happen um, so yeah I dropped him off over there this morning and guys I seriously almost broke down I was like oh my god you know it's different I have left him with his dad before when I've um, taken taken sub jobs or whatever but I was at work I was doing something but just to drop him off so that, you know, I can just sit on my butt. <sighs> yeah, I feel bad about that. And for the first couple of hours, I did think about him. I, You know, his stuff is everywhere. So I was just looking at all his stuff. And I was like, oh my God, I miss him. And um, his grandparents aren't really just tech savvy. But I just wanted to ask them to send me pictures of him throughout the day. But, um... Yeah, I made it. It's now um, 3.30 where I am. And I'm about to go and pick him up. I dropped him off at about 8. Um, and when we leave here, we're going to go to his other grandparents' house. And we're going to um, have dinner with them. But, yeah. About my pregnancy, I am starting to really, really, really feel pregnant. I have a bump now. I didn't have one before. I do have a bump. Um, it's hard for me to take showers. I'm going to ask my doctor about this. Uh, the other day I was taking a shower and I was just washing my hair and I have a lot of hair. Um, so I was washing my hair or whatever. I didn't feel like I was in there for that long though. I feel like I probably was in there for about, mm, I don't know, 10-15 minutes. And I just felt like I was going to faint. So I had to get out of the shower. Like, usually I'm the type of person where I don't like hair touching my neck or shampoo or conditioner or anything like that. I don't like stuff dripping everywhere. Um, but this day, I did not care. I ran to get a bottle of cold water and I literally, like, laid there on the floor. If I didn't do that, I'm 100% sure I would have passed out. That's one reason. Um, another reason is I've been getting these crazy headaches. And I'm not just talking about the, you know, oh, I have a headache, blah, blah, blah. No, I'm talking about those. Oh, my God. The world is ending. This is the worst headache ever. Yeah. I've gotten those like three times. And so, I'm thinking, you know, I gained so much weight with MJ. I never lost it. I got pregnant again. What if it's preeclampsia? <clears throat> so, um, I Googled it and stuff. And I'm like, oh, damn, you know, they say you get headaches and stuff. And I was just thinking, oh, gosh, please don't let this, you know, happen. Don't let this be the case. So, I had went to get my blood pressure taken. And it, they did it three times. And it was 102 over 74 and the second time, the third time. And the second time it was 107 over 75, the second and first time. So I don't think it was the blood pressure. It didn't seem like it was, you know, really high or anything. But, um, I talked to my mama and she said, maybe I'm not getting enough sleep. Maybe I'm not getting enough fluids. 
And I mean, I think she might be onto something because today, of course, I've been getting a lot of sleep because um, MJ is gone. And I seriously feel like a million bucks. I feel like I'm on cloud nine. <laughs> oh my gosh, that sounds really bad. But I feel great. Um, so yeah, maybe I should just... I don't know though. I thought I was getting good sleep. Maybe I should just get better naps. Because I slept like I usually do yesterday. But I had like a two hour nap today. Oh my god, it feels so good. Anyway, yeah, um, I think I felt the baby move. With MJ, I first felt him kicking at 17 weeks, 6 days. And I mean, he it, those were definite kicks that I was feeling. He was really feisty. Now, this baby, I was just telling my husband, I was like, damn, you know, they say you feel the second baby a lot quicker than you feel the first baby. And I was telling him, you know, I expected to feel this baby like 14, 15 weeks. Um, yeah, that's, I don't even know if that's possible, but I feel like, I think I felt him moving a couple of times um, the past few weeks. But I'm not really sure, but I really want to say I felt him moving uh, yesterday and the day before. But I'm still not sure with MJ. They were just so, you know, they were hard, definite kicks. But I think I'm feeling him moving now. Or kicking, whatever he's doing. Um, I'm feeling him a lot higher up, though. MJ, I felt it in my privates. He would be kicking down there. This baby, um, I'm feeling it more towards my navel area. Um, yeah. Anything else? This is going to be a short video because, I mean, nothing has happened. Nothing at all. Um, I have my doctor's appointment next week, so maybe that'll be more interesting. I don't know because my doctor is so boring. But, um, yeah, last week, as you all know, was MJ's first Thanksgiving. Oh, he was so cute. He was adorable. He had on um, a red sweater. His first real big boy outfit a red sweater red polo sweater jeans he had on boots his hair was brushed i i rarely brush his hair i mean because he doesn't really have much but i brushed his hair and he was so adorable like people are still complimenting me on how cute he was and the crazy thing is that I didn't even pick out the outfit. I told my husband, we bought the sweater before he was born. My husband, he said, do you like this sweater? I was like, yeah, we definitely got to get that. That's the only contribution I made to the whole outfit. But my husband, he has really good taste. Um, everybody was just, you know, flabbergasted about his appearance. But we really want him to look nice, you know, especially during the holidays because you take pictures and he's going to have to look back on those pictures and yeah he'll know that he was loved those because he looks so nice <laughs> but um that was a joke but yeah that's pretty much all that's been going on <sighs> my life has been pretty much boring I haven't been doing anything that's pretty much it if I missed anything, let me know. I'm going to try to remember to put the pictures up of MJ and put a belly shot picture up. I'm going to make my husband take a picture. I'm going to make him remind me. You know, uh, <laughs> this video is uh, recorded on Friday, but it probably won't go up until um, Saturday or Sunday since I'm going to be busy tonight. And I don't even know what tomorrow is going to look like. And before I go, excuse the background because this is my husband's workout room. And I noticed there's stuff on the floor and stuff like that. And um, that's pretty much it. But for the people who are following me for my hair, I just have my hair. I deep conditioned it for two days. And I rinsed it out yesterday. And I detangled and um, I used the Kemetube leave-ins. 
And like I always do, I don't even know why I mention it anymore. I always do that. And I use Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner. I never, I, I rarely use that anymore, but oh my God, it, it made, everything was so easy last night. Like I did my hair so quick. And I just put it in these huge twisters, you can see. They do not look good. They're not even um, presentable right now. They're still pretty wet. Because um, I rinsed it out late, late last night, the conditioner, and added the leave-ins late, late last night. But um, I just put the scarf on because, I mean, their roots uh, of the twist are really, really puffy. But, um, you know, maybe I might do them do the front ones over and let them um, dry better somehow some way um i did i noticed i did the same thing when i was pregnant with mj and i'm gonna try to post a picture of those i was so um much lazier or so much more easily tired that um my hair i started doing bigger twists but i think that really didn't affect it much at all uh, as far as growth goes because it was still growing um but i'll post pictures of those twists some of you probably remember if you follow me on my other channel but um yeah thank you for watching i hope the video wasn't too boring too all over the place I hope i didn't say on oh, too much um <laughs> thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next week i guess Ciao.